Aloha from Hawaii. Welcome back, you beautiful people. In today's episode, we're going, I'm going to slide down that hill. <laughs> and I'm going to like go through that river. <laughs> One of the small luxuries that I like to occasionally get on the weekends is a cappuccino from a small mom and pop shop. There's lots of different mom and, place, mom and pop places on this island. The food is amazing. Why do adults drink coffee so much? Definitely not the waves for boogie boarding, but you gotta make your own waves. Yay! Yeah, well, yeah, but you gotta get to the other side. You gotta cross the river. Put there. I, I'm gonna do it with her? Okay, we're gonna do it together, kid. Okay, hold me up. <laughs> I want to go ride a rabbit. All the other kids are like jumping like five to 10 feet out and down. And then there's Alex. Every kid starts somewhere. that one on camera. Did you see that where he was next to you and he flew like Superman and like launched? You didn't, it was like right next to you. much action this day but you know she was always there she's loves to play in the sand she was making a lot of friends they were digging like a canal out for the river to bypass the main way you know they were having a good time so much fun with all these other kids, letting them use our boards. It was a great time. Some of them were even like, are you gonna be here all day? They left and went and bought their own boards and then came back crazy.
And then one of the best things about YMA is that there's so much variety to do. So I had the chance to go snorkeling. John was watching the girls. The ocean was calm enough. And I haven't been snorkeling in YMA since last summer. But I've learned a lot of things since last summer. And one of those things is that the best snorkeling is actually not in the center of the bay where it may look nice and beautiful and clear with the sandy bottom, but over to the side along those rocks, which you gotta be careful if you gotta watch the currents, you gotta watch the, the swell and the tide and all that stuff. But today was perfect and I'm really working on my ability to dive down. I really need to get some diving fins and I need to probably get a diving belt because I, I float. But I'm really learning a lot in terms of pressurizing my ears, getting down deeper, holding my breath longer. I felt amazing that day. I have never been able to stay down or get down that far before and it was just beautiful. I thought I could hear some of the whales when I was snorkeling and you could see them when I was on shore. You could actually look out and see them. And I, so I tried to get the drone and shoot it out over there, but ah, it's just, I don't think the drone could go out that far. I don't have, I have a very, I have like the original Mavic Mini and it just could not go out that far because I had to keep it pretty low because all the helicopters flying overhead like nonstop, all everyone's helicopter tour, so I had to keep the sky pretty low. And it still turned out to be a pretty beautiful shot. Just no whales, though. You can see the whales out there, dude. Oh, I'll take a 
fine. you guys hopefully you had a wonderful Easter weekend and if you don't celebrate Easter I hope you had a wonderful weekend regardless we'll see you on the next episode Cheers.